we had a couple of properties go to auction last Saturday and also the week prior that sold for 5, 10, 15% above the price guide. And one property in particular last week that sold was an incredible result, sold well, well, well over the price guide. So how does that actually happen? Uh, as agents, when we look at a property and provide an appraisal or a valuer looks at a property, what we look at is bedroom sizes, construction, land size, location, and we look at what's sold comparable to that, and we come up with a mathematical number. The one thing that we actually can't put a price on is the emotional value of a property. And what I mean by that is, it's about demand supply. It's about scarcity of when's the last time the property sold or when's the last time a property in a particular street sold. It's about location, maybe strategically buying a property over a five, 10 year plan for further development, um, or it might, might just be about being close to family, school or work. So those sort of things is always hard to put a price on. And for some potential buyers, that might be worth $20,000. For some people, it might be worth 200 or three or $500,000. They're prepared to pay more just to get that property to be in that spot. So you have to remember that price guides are based on a mathematical number of what's sold and just the, the general facts of a property, yet the emotional number is very hard to estimate because every single person's situation is going to be different. And that's why sometimes at auctions, you get results that are well above expectations because no one knows exactly how much that property is worth for a particular purchaser.